<laughs> um, don't know what the renegades do though. That's why we're going to explore them. That's why we are going to explore them, because we can learn together. You know, as even some of you out there, that you've probably played with the renegades. I know they've been um, displayed in the live stream and stuff, but I haven't played them. I know they contradict with the. They got the butterfly symbol, um, the paragons, the purple, the purple, blah, 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 those, those people. Hi everyone, my name is Rachel and welcome back to The Sims 4, featuring the Pleasants and the Burbs in the last uh, episode. I believe, yep. Uh, John? John, yes, good old John. He finally got his promotion after so, so long. And if you play this game, I know some of you may do, you may understand that it is really difficult to progress quickly and get money. <laughs> it's a challenge, it's a challenge. You, no, you, you try, you try doing a 1 million smelling challenge in this game, I swear. You'll be here for a while. And you, <laughs> I'm doing. I'm doing that challenge in The Sims 2, and yeah, hmm. I'm almost uh, near 100,000 millions, I think. Yeah, don't quote me on that. I'm. I'm a bit wary of numbers. <laughs> but when the when I start recording, I always check at the bottom of the screen to see how much money I've got. And, I can never remember. <laughs> After two weeks, I don't write it down. I just like just let it go as it is, and then just, just see the number four. Ah, oh, yes, that's where we were. That's what we were doing. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear. You know, maybe, maybe, maybe I'll slow my speech down because <laughs> I always get a bit overexcited when I oh, yeah I start up the video and then I go. Ch -ch 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 I just gotta slow it down a little bit more. So, I just forgot what I was going to say as well. Oh well. Um, oh yes, I'll, I'll, I, I thought, I thought about uh, doing a one million to million challenge, but that may be very similar to what we're doing right now. Though even though we're trying to, well, the Pleasants were trying to earn enough money to uh, get to their home, and that's it. That's the whole caboodle of a channel, channel, challenge. <laughs> and with um, uh, you're playful, very playful, aren't you, um, Daniel? You, you go, you go, you go, you. You're ill or something. You, you got the giggles. <laughs> He's got the giggles. <laughs> I've always got the giggles. I'm weird. So. Maybe in a future episode, no, future video, future series, I may go to the 1 million to million challenge once I'm done with The Sims 2 and uh, left enough time for The Sims 4 to uh, rejuvenate and evaporate into something different. Because I do have one plan already, and that's um, have crazy adventures with uh, my sim self and their friends. And <laughs> I thought it might be a laugh, I thought. Um, but I have to um, uh, ask the friends in question if I could play with their sims and uh, put them in videos and have crazy adventures and play with their wishes. Um, they may... Uh, ev ev Why do I want to say evaporate? I don't know. They may want to evaporate to the video and um, do their own little commentary in the comment section. I think that would be pretty cool actually. So, um, once I've done all this, now try to keep that in mind, and um, I've already got a plan for another series. I've already written that idea down, but I may push that back until I finish playing with <laughs> the rubbish, the Sims selves. Though, of course, I'll need to make um, a plot to it, um, a story. So I thought, well, since I've done a challenge here, why don't I go and play with a story and see how that goes? Something different. I don't know how long that will take though. I don't know what story we'll have. Um, but we'll see about that. Because I have been playing clubs with our sims. And 
Is this his hands? <laughs> so setting up a club, I mean, my sim is pretty hilarious. Uh, as, as I've said in the, I keep putting my hands up to explain things, but you can't see me in this frame. Can't see my hands. It's a little bit of a frame right here. Um, so it's really funny with the clubs in our sims because uh, we're in multiple clubs. Clubs, yeah. The, the club that I forgot the name of it last time was Spin Masters. It was Spin Masters, those ones. <laughs> so yeah, Spin Masters. I forgot what, I, what what name I called them previously, but they're definitely Spin Masters. I can assure you on that. I also talked about that the first ever club I made was uh, Das Wunderbar Die, Das Wunderbar Die, which uh, is a translation from German, uh, the wonderful free, because uh, yeah, wonderful. I don't want to, to uh, use German to make it sound badass. <laughs> so yes, uh, what did we do, Das Wunderbar Die? Um, well. We went to the club and danced and played with the, the sound system, <laughs> that's what we did. <laughs> um, so we got lots of points from doing that, all we did was just uh, raised up our dancing skills, we went to attend to some uh, parties and stuff. And then um, I got those uh, cardboard dance mat things, and then I bought uh, the the DJ booth the thing and uh, my himself worked on that. From what? Yeah. There there, there is um, five levels for the dance skill. All of the Sims have uh, surpassed them, but my himself is halfway through the DJ skill. So there's I think there's roughly ten, ten skills there. Um. So far, I've like, opened up the option to you know, connect the TVs together and put a little animation on there as well. So it's pretty, pretty cool. It kind of um, strong it strengths up the experience of the party. Yeah, the back of the video. Um, hmm. Angela, she's a bit sad and lonely. Oh well. Um. <laughs> She'll be fine, she'll be fine. I don't know what time it is actually. It's uh, nearly six o'clock. Too bad. So what we're doing right here is that um, when you do a bit of fishing, when you do a bit of fishing, you, even if it's bad or good, you still get, see if you look at the top corner, it's five simoleons for a goldfish, what uh, Lilith picked up. Now, of course, this is going to sound too obvious if you play the game and you're an avid player. Um, for the type of quality of each fish, um, the uh, price offer is higher, is greater. So if you have a foul fish, it could quite possibly be, be five simoleons. If you have an excellent or an outstanding fish, um, yeah, definitely an outstanding. Yeah, sim yeah, one of my sims and another save did get an, an outstanding fish. And that was around 200 something some aliens, a little bit higher. There you go, remember? It's somewhere around there. <laughs> um, so it's uh, over there and all over the place. So, my intention here is to get the two to. Um, raise up their fishing skill to get better fish, obviously. <laughs> and with what Mary Sue is doing, just clicked it, click, clicking, collecting up uh, little bits and bobs around and then sell them. Just like we're doing with the fruits and stuff. So it's, it's the weekend, it's the bit of the odd time of the week where nothing really happens, but once I've uh, you know, recorded more videos, we'll get the clubs up and running and we can mess around with those. So I'm looking forward to that. I thought it was snowing. But it's raining. You know, I'll talk about the snow in a bit. Because <laughs> you know what I'm like. I always go into another story and then I forget what I was talking about. So, um, I am thinking about working where Lilith and exploring the Renegades. Oh, it's coming down. <laughs> oh, Renegades, not weather. Um, 
So exploring the Renegades, because I personally haven't explored the Renegades myself, and I thought that would be a perfect, perfect club for Lilith. So, as soon as I am ready to record more videos of the Pleasants, I'll go and do the first thing there. Um, I'm just thinking, when will be the best time to do it? Ooh, <laughs> we'll see how it all pans out, because it's a time frame of earning money, and then going to the clubs, getting your sleep. Uh, so it's a bit... Ooh, we're just scheduled and everything. So the best time for me personally would be doing it around the weekend. I think because nothing is happening there. But also I think that Lilith should get a job just to help out, I think. Yeah, it could be a good idea. So at some point we'll definitely do that. And if we have time we'll do it in this half of the video. If not, we'll do it next time. This would be a good idea. This isn't she went through that rock. Okay, fair enough. So the more money we get, the quicker we're going to get the house. And that, at the minute we have 25,736 simoleons. So that's not too bad. It's not too bad actually. So we're doing well, we're doing well. A little bit slower than The Sims 2, but still we're doing well. It would help if we could dig underground and get up little bits and bobs. That would help quite a lot. Really it would. That's what we're doing in The Sims 2. Digging up all of the ground, making a mess, <laughs> and then the dogs come by, they dig up and make a mess. But still, it really, really does help, and I hope that, um, uh, thing, that, um, option gets, Im gets implemented back into The Sims 4, that would be great. Um, so, the, the weather, I was gonna talk about the weather. <laughs> it, was, it was just coming down, um, just looking outside the window, I can't tell if it's actually snow or rain. Because we were, because we are expecting a bit of snow. Um, I kept checking my um, weather forecast on my phone. It says there's going to be a little sprinkle of snow today, and yet it didn't. So I'm looking out there. I'm seeing rain looks a bit thick. <laughs> As you do say that every day. The rain. Normally it's a little bit more you know, wet, and snow is a little bit more thicker. So it's, I just keep see, I keep seeing some some things float across and to float down. So I don't know. It's a double check as well. It's a double check and keep my eye out. Um, not that I have a problem with snow at all. I mean, we do need some snow to keep um, the environment a bit more you know, fresh and everything. That's what we need. Snow happens for a reason. It doesn't just appear like, you know, baking powder or something. <laughs> it's just, it's there for a reason. Like it gets spring for a reason. That's when all the little flowers plop out. And the earth becomes hot for a reason because that's what it does. And it becomes autumn for a reason because that's what it does. Because it's seasons. <laughs> um, yeah, I just want to. I, I just really want to keep staring out the window and see what is happening out there. But you know, we'll see. I'll do it when I'm finished with you. See what's happening. Uh, but yeah, I really hope it does snow. That'd be great. That'd be really, really great. That would be awesome. Oh. I can't remember when the last time I snowed, or did I? It, wait, yeah, I know. It was last year. This time last year it was, I think, because I was on Facebook and. Uh, you know the memories, memories option you get. Facebook always notifies me that I've got uh, memories to uh, look at. Though I think I clicked uh, notify me when there's new memories. <laughs> so it's always, it's always interesting to see what I did last year, two years ago, three years ago, four years ago, and five years ago. Because I've been on Facebook for roughly five years now. Um, even though I got the internet back in 2010. Ooh. <laughs> oh, here we go. Get okay, a job for Lilith. Let's see which is the best one. Um, do we want her to look after kids? Mm, no. <laughs> hmm. We want the highest paying job. But, yeah, we don't want anything rubbish though. <laughs> 
Um, shelf stocker. Hmm. Retail employee. Fast food employee. At 16 an hour. No, I don't want that. No. <laughs> that is awful pay, that is. Barista, that's 28. Is that a little bit more than the manual labourer? Hmm, no. No, actually, the barista thing really fits for the get to work. No, get together expansion. Uh, now she's in a manual labour career. Whoop, 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 whoop. And she goes to work in seven days in a week's time. So. I don't think she'll stay too long at work, because Angela, Angela, she's at a, she does the same work and I think it's only for four hours. Oh, eight hours a weekend, so four hours on Saturday and four hours on Sunday. Here we are in a burp household. Uh, don't know who we're going to go with today. We'll see. <laughs> maybe we might still work with, um, or maybe we'll work with Jennifer. Probably, I don't know. <laughs> I don't remember putting the toilet in the bedroom though. When did I put the toilet in there? It's been so long, I just can't remember what I did. <laughs> in, 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 in building terms, in building terms. I mean, I definitely do remember putting those bars up things, just having a look at them. I just, just, I just left them there. But with the toilet, I just don't remember putting the toilet in there. And I don't really remember putting chairs down either. Oh, my memory is really awful. Oh <laughs> well, uh, I think we'll be fine. I'll be fine. Don't worry. We'll, we'll get this all sorted, and it'll, be, it'll go smoothly and swimmingly. Um, but um, so we'll, we'll definitely manage. We'll be able to um, play with the clubs during the weekend, or at some point uh, during the week. Because I know Mary Sue has the day off during the week. I think. So we can play with the clubs then as well, and see where that takes us. I think that'll be a nice little change of pace of what we're doing right now. Um, yeah, yeah, be, 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 be fun commentary, commentary as well. Yeah, yeah, I can't wait to do that. Actually, It'll be fun. And um, hmm, do they have their own, you know, club unicorn thing? So they all dress similar. I love they dress similar. I don't know. <laughs> oh, we'll see. We'll see. I don't want to stress myself out too much. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah. Um, don't know what the renegades do though. That's why we're going to explore them. That's why we are going to explore them. Because we can learn together, you know, as even some of you out there, they, you've probably played with the Renegades. I know they've been um, displayed in the live stream and stuff, but I haven't played with them. I know they contradict with the... Oh, what's their name? They got the butterfly symbol. Um, the Paragons, the Paragons, the Paragons, the Paragons, the Paragons, the Paragons, those people. <laughs> Just looking at the time. Um, it's just gone 18 minutes, 18 minutes. I've just lost internet. Oh well, it's not exactly I need it right now. That's fine by me. It's not a problem, see if I can turn it back on. Hey, internet, I ordered you to come back on. This is the right one. Rolling, 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 rolling. There we go, we're back on again. Whoop, whoop. We're fine, we'll survive. <laughs> um, actually, how many minutes have we got left? Just over six minutes left. Well, wow, time has flown, time has flown, even though this is relatively shorter. So it's kind of a regular, <laughs> regular amount of time. So, it's okay, we've got the, the bare meat and bones into this video. I've got an idea of what we want to do next time. And uh, what we want to do in the future. Um. Oh dear. <laughs> this, this friggin. 
air. I, I, when I talk a lot, a lot of air goes inside me. And just, my belly starts talking. It's really annoying. <laughs> really is. Um, but, oh well, oh well, oh well. I'm, I'll, I'll manage, I'll manage. I'll be fine. Um, I'm just thinking. Just thinking now. Um, so I've already got things set up for the next episode. And what we want to do. Uh, who, I wonder? Um, should I play with clubs with the burbs as well? Because Lucy, she can join a kids club. And uh, join Jennifer today. Um, she can join a kids club and see how that goes. And see what they do. Because we will we, we'll be looking mainly at the adult club. Mm hmm. Um. Pay those bills would be a good idea. Oh, uh, mainly looking at the adults club, and they would be a, a good interest to you know see what kids do, see what they what what fun they do, and see if they do their homework. There's gonna be probably there's gonna be probably one of those clubs that I'm gonna join. That's that says don't do homework. We're gonna do fun and explore things. <laughs> oh yeah, no, it'll be fun either way. It'll be fun. Uh, new, new Sims to look at, new Sims to talk about, and new places to go. Um, we might hang out in Windenburg. That's a really nice place. It really is a really nice place. It feels more like at home. If you know what I mean? Um, it's not all Americanized things. It's more homely. It's more. Um, it's got an essence of <laughs> all over the place. It's not just like one scablodge. It's all nicely connected to everything. There's loads of Tudor houses, and there are loads of Tudor buildings here. So it's pretty cool, pretty cool. So it feels quite homely. It really does. Um, I was thinking, what other landmarks are there? That quite a few countryside. Um, few um, old ruins as well yeah pretty nifty so if you don't have get together I definitely recommend you getting it it's pretty awesome um, just just all the the, the aesthetic of um, the, the, of Windenburg it's pretty it's really it, it's 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 we go. Um, I mean, I do recommend um, popping to the pub, one of the pubs or something. And um, they have these um, theme nights. Yeah, the theme nights. Um, sometimes they have ghost theme nights, um, night nights, <laughs> uh, bear nights. That's if you have. Um, Oh, that pack where you go out into the woods. Um, oh, what is it called? That pack it has bears in it, and you go on holiday to the woods. Um, let's not get outside. <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm gonna leave it at that today. That's the end of the video. <laughs> Cause I'm, I'll, be, I'll be bugging myself to. To try to remember what that pack is. You know, people have kicked at me once I've turned off this camera. Yeah, probably will. But anyway, I want to thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, if, if you did, leave it a like if you really, really liked it. Leave it a favourite. Also, if you're on the channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. That'll make my day completely. And as always, I hope to see you in my very next video. I will talk to you all later. Uh, bye bye. Mwah.